First of all, I'd like to say how beautiful Diana is tonight. Give it up, come on, she's beautiful, Maneev. Not too shabby. Clearly, Diana dressed you. <laughs> we are in Chicago at the Renaissance Hotel celebrating the beautiful wedding of Diana and Maneev. Obviously, Diana is stunningly beautiful. Kind, ambitious, energetic. Charming and eloquent. Bossy, but in a good way. Very early on, she's always just been very driven, and that's what the bossiness comes from, but it, it's in a very good way. It's like she makes things happen that otherwise wouldn't have happened. Maneev is, he's himself, like unabashedly. You have to learn his little nuances and the little jokes that he has. And once you do, you feel like you're in and you're cool and you get it. He kind of took me under his wing. I was a few years younger than he was in, in the residency program. And uh, he really befriended me and kind of let me hang out with all of his friends who all later became my friends. And that's really kind of speaks about who he is. What's crazy about today and really interesting about today is that last night we had a huge grand opening party for our business, the groomsman suit that Diana and I run together. Fun fact, tomorrow is my wedding, and so you guys are all at my rehearsal dinner right now. Thank you so much for coming! It is a online suit company. The reason I'm wearing a tuxedo today. They love their customers, they love the guys, and they're so helpful to them, getting them to all look sharp. The dynamic with Jeannie's engineering and her technical design skill, Diana doing the marketing, just blossom. I would assume that there will be some groomsmen and probably the groom himself wearing a groomsman suit. Well, it is a huge day. It's the most important wedding we've ever outfitted. We made a custom jacket for Maneeb. He basically had a huge part in designing. And then to outfit this huge group of guys, they all look amazing. To see your product on your friends and family is, you know, there's nothing better. Is there a, uh, a moment for you in their relationship that you kind of knew, oh, this is meant to be, like they're definitely getting married? The Antigua boat trip, because it was, small quarters for a whole week and just to see how they interact like they communicate surprisingly well even though you know they'll say that they're, they're always working on it but they like they're perfect for each other It always hits me at like a weird moment that I can't predict. Um, I think it might be like once the dress goes on and that like and it's really happening and we're all here and my mom will probably set me off because when she starts crying then everybody's got to cry. <laughs> Diana and Maneeb, you two have come such a long way since you first met at that swanky bar in Boston on your first date. You have connected friends, family. You've endured the difficulties of a long distance relationship only to find that your connection is stronger when you're together. Which brings us here. When I first met you both, I was truly, truly struck by your love and connection for one another. Maneeb, you telling me about how much you loved Diana's eyes and her smile, even the quirky things you loved, like the ways her knuckles would get dry when she ran in the winter. <laughs> I thought she had psoriasis. <laughs> Maneeb is a true partner. He's not just a pretty face, you guys. And while at first he may appear, como se dice, douchey? <laughs> deep, deep, way deep down. He's, he's got a good heart. Unconventional for sure, but great nonetheless. 
Diana is stunningly beautiful, extremely kind, and wildly charismatic. Anyone who has spent any time with her knows that when you meet her, she's someone you want to include in your life more, than, more and more. Seeing you grow into this incredible person, professionally and personally, it just makes me really proud. We are both excited to have you both in Chicago. Super excited. And we wish you all the best. I love you, Di. And I just am so glad you're finally in Chicago and we live in the same city. And just, I don't know how everything has worked out over the last couple of years. It's all like it's, it's just been meant to be. It's great to see you happy. Just about three and a half years ago, a girl walked into a bar in Boston, not too dissimilar from this, to find a handsome man waiting for her. And they spent the night laughing at her jokes, not his. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. <laughs> Fast forward to tonight, where I am standing in front of my best friend, surrounded by our closest friends and family. Um, the journey to get here hasn't been easy, but throughout it all, you've been my champion, my greatest source of strength. You are my incredible Hulk, the Maui to my Moana, <laughs> my cookie monster, my tailgate buddy, but most of all, you are my Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Yes! So, uh, it's kind of tough to say. Uh, many of you don't know this, but uh, my my dad was diagnosed with acute leukemia about two months ago. I flew down to San Diego earlier this week to be there for him and get worked up for what we both have coming. So I thought, what, what better timing to ask uh, the man that I look up to, the man that I adore, what he thinks about me getting married. And he said, it's not easy. You will suffer at times. <laughs> But be better than you are and make it worthwhile. It's the things that are most difficult and take the most time that are the most worthwhile. I promise to be better than I am. I promise, similar to tonight, to when life gets a little cold, to turn you into a sauna. <laughs> I am now so pleased to now pronounce you husband and wife, Dr. Manee and Diana Sana.